Welcome to the AFR Saints channel, where we provide you daily content on your favorite team, the New Orleans Saints. Do us a favor and hit that subscribe button. Be sure to leave your comments below and smash that like button. Who that? Our friends at Over the Cap have finalized um, their compensatory pick projections. If you don't follow Nick Court on Twitter, you should. Um, so Over the Cap, it, it, for what it's worth, the um, the NFL does not reveal its uh, its compensatory pick formula. But a lot of people will try to reverse engineer it to figure out what the, the structure is that they use to figure out the the compensatory pick formula. So over the cap is a website. Nick Court does he basically tries to reverse engineer to come up with all the compensatory picks. And what he has done for the Saints is um he is projecting three picks, a compensatory picks for the Saints. For those that don't know, I'll oversimplify this. If you lose free agents and don't recoup uh, equivalent value in free agents, you can get a compensatory pick. I'm way, way, way oversimplifying that, but that's essentially what it was. So, for example, the Saints lost David Onyemata, Marcus Davenport, and Caden Ellis in free agency last year. So Nick Court is projecting the Saints are going to get three compensatory picks, one for each of those players, and he's got them all as fifth-round picks. So as it stands right now, the Saints have their first pick at number 14, a uh, second round pick, which is the Broncos' second round pick, number 45. The Saints do not have their third or fourth round picks. So that's why this is really significant. They have their fifth, but then Nick Court is projecting the Saints to get three compensatory fifth round picks. So the Saints would have a one, a two, four fifth round picks, two sixth round picks, and the seventh round pick from the Denver Broncos. By the way, one of the six round picks is one from the Eagles as a result of the trade from two years ago. So in any event, a one, a two, four fifth-round picks, two sixes, and a seven is what uh, they're projecting for for the New Orleans Saints. Uh, that is just a lot of trade bait for Mickey Loomis uh, to go send to someone else uh, to move up and take a punter. But uh, if you're wondering, by the way, the, um, the picks that Nick Cord is projecting the Saints get are picks 167, 168, and 172. Uh, last year, pick 167 was Henry Tooto, the linebacker from Tennessee, uh, Alabama via Tennessee. Uh, Herman Johnson was pick 167, former LSU American offensive lineman. Pick 168, the Saints took Carl Nix at pick 168. Uh, and nobody good ever really was taken at pick 172, at least not in the last 25 years or so. But the Saints did draft Mike Haas at uh, at 172. Not Mike Haas, the play-by-play -play man. Mike Haas, the receiver from Oregon State back in 2006, uh, Peyton's first draft in New Orleans. So anyway, Saints projected to get three compensatory picks uh, courtesy of Nick Court over at Over the Cap. We don't find out until like a week before the league year, so we'll find out like in March with the actual uh, formula reveals, but he's usually really, really, really accurate. So uh, we'll find out. Hey, thanks so much for watching. Please leave your comments. I love to interact. And be sure to hit the red subscribe button below.